What's up everybody? It's Kirk Maxwell. Yes, it's been a while since I made a YouTube video and to be honest, I'm not too sure if I want to stay on YouTube considering how uh, corrupt I've gotten over the, the last few months. But this is Space Engineers and well, there's a mod out there for a planet, actually seemed to be a system, got Argus, as I believe it's called. And it's super popular right now where basically you land on a planet that has several factions fighting over this planet. And you can join the good guys and carve out back the resources that the, uh, the friendly factions need in order to survive. Well, on top of that, some madman, mad lad put uh, another mod of that on top of that called Industrial Mod. So not only are you getting the basic resources you would in Space Engineers, but now you're getting more complex and more involved ingredients such as copper, bauxite, uh, titanium, and other ores that you would never find in vanilla space engineers. Now the reason why I'm recording this is because I just made myself a underwater base which I thought was extremely cool and found myself a way station that was under attack and protected it with a helicopter that I built. The helo though he is very, very vulnerable to enemy fire. So if I come across anybody that's faster than me, I'm doomed. And unfortunately for me, between this west rust station I found and my sea base are, is a very dangerous enemy research facility that if I get too close to, it will launch all kinds of jet fighter freaking drones after me to shoot me down. So I'm recording to see well, to show you guys how dangerous this can be, I got real guns on my helicopter, by the way, and propeller is freaking awesome like that. Am I actually in the helo? Yes. All right, I wanted to show you guys whether or not I can get back to base and not get myself killed. As you can see here, the blades are pretty loud. That's some backside bottle box I found there. And there, the uh, white marker there, the security office, was the ones attacking this nice little weight station I found. I'm turning my bobs to repair my helicopter. Last time I flew too far to the, let's see, that's west. Or south, no. Nope. Too far to the south, and I was attacked by a research station. I'll get back in here. This might be a long flight, this might be a short flight. We'll find out. The station behind me, that's 13 kilometers away, is a frontier outpost, and it's not as dangerous as the research center, because all it has is, a, well, it does have auto cannons on it, which shoot out at like three kilometers and when they whiz by you they uh, scare the heck out of you but now I'm gonna go hopefully over these mountains and avoid any danger oh yeah putting dampeners on means I'm gonna be no more noisy but it also helps with because every time I try to get more altitude you're gonna hear the propellers See? right now I need the altitude in order to get over these mountains so time to be noisy now my rail guns I gotta figure out a way I'll put my rail guns on like a different key bind in the left mouse click because if I have the mouse, left mouse click I want to shoot my Gatling guns so I have on the front of the helicopter I also have four missiles equiped and I used to have bombs before I used them up on the uh, base, the white base back there, the security outpost. That place wasn't that dangerous. All it had was one Gatling cannon and several interior turrets. Now, if I remember right, the security base, the not security base, the research base is like that direction. 
So I gotta. Oh, oh, what was this? Anar defeats defense installation. Anar is all over the place. I'm trying to get some altitude so I can glide back down to my base. It's freaking 12 kilometers. Oh, was it more than 12? Let me see. Yeah, 16 kilometers away. <laughs> I'm going slow. 70? Yeah. But no. Over the mountains. Avoid the research base. Defense installation does not bother me at all. Because the worst they can do is lob some shells in my direction, that's about it. But then I can nuke them down with my real guns. I just want to get to the water. I want to get to the water. I'm gonna keep this helo because it's great for moving resources, doing trade, stuff like that. But it's horrendous when it comes to fighting uh, any fast moving targets. And I need I have a fighter jet to handle those. Uh, that's gonna require also either that or a tank. That's what I'm gonna be. So you guys can write down in the comments below whether you're allowed to see a tank, a big mobile fortress or fighter jet. I got my really really I got the blueprints for a Tomcat. And I really want to build that. I built already these two and they're both really pretty fighters. And I have a uh, aerodynamics mod installed. And you can see in the very small corner on the left hand side, top corner, a readout for the air, um, velocity of air in the, for the mod. Oh, oh, you went too far to the right. No, 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 no. Also, it might help if I turn off my beacon. I'm broadcasting where I am right now. I mean, as long as I don't see the research place, which is like right over there. Between the road, they see the horizon and where I am right now. What's that? What's that? <coughs> Another outpost. I'm just surrounded by bad guys. I mean, how far away is that outpost? 13? It's actually not that far away from my base. I might have to poke at it. As long as it's not near my oh. oh what's that below me? What's that below me? That is Copper! I found copper! Hold up. I got a GPS this. Mine! Mine! They call it a mine! <laughs> I gotta start myself a copper freaking manual station there. So definitely do that. But no, main objective is A, get back to base. Maybe poke at that outpost over in front of us. Yeah, and not piss off drones, enemy drones, because they will tear me to pieces. I got one behind me, I got one in front of me. So far enough seen any enemy uh oh wow, I just noticed that I built a freaking sea base and an inlet like this. Should have done it further out in the ocean. The main reason I want to get back to my base is because I have all my fortress defenses shut down right now. Which I'll need online if the outpost sends any drones after me. I move pretty slow, they'll probably all shoot me down before I'm close to my base. Okay, make my descent. need my dampeners on so I'm going down 
Actually, another one for long of a trip after all. I thought it would be much longer. 15 minutes? 20 minutes? I could have sworn I built that place further out in the ocean. I gotta re re redecorate. Well, not redecorate. Remove. Relocate. That's what I'm looking for. Too fast. Too fast. Yes, helicopters can go on the water. <laughs> and space engineers. Don't ask me why. See, we got a lot of gun turrets there. Need to land, but I gotta be very careful. Because unfortunately, I have landing gear on this thing, and landing gears do not take a hit. Or crap, unlike tires. Come on. I'm gonna do a lot of spitting here. Uh. Not a helicopter pilot. I'm not a helicopter pilot. Slow me down. Slow me down. So close. Ah! So close. Land. Alright. Shut the engines off. Shut the engines off. Yep, see, I lost landing gear already. Alright, I'll get back to you guys when I finally got wheels on this thing and. So basically what I'm going to go poke at that base over there and start a fire with. Harvest it. Picking up multiple fixit personnel in the area. Proceed with harvest before it's too late. is alien artifacts. I grabbed the artifact, and now they're coming to get me. They want it back. She can't have it. Get off my yard. It's my artifact. It belongs in a museum. But seriously, though, this little tiny pea gunner. Pea shooter. I gotta get the job done. I didn't see if my guns, all my guns are loaded. Let's go, boys. Wait, what am I going down for? What am I going down for? No, it should be going up.
So I did see an enemy. Faulted or doom right there. <laughs> Don't know why. This is not up. We've come from space afar. Space dungeons. You've been warned. A signal appears on your detector. Powered by your ship's reactor. That's glorious. <laughs> it's glorious. Why are you not far? I don't know why I'm doing this the hard way. Took care of them all, friend. Well, I'll teach you bastards to get on my lawn. I'm impressed. I'm very impressed with my guns. And I have my artifact right down there. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching.